what is up guys this is just a shorter live I will record um I, I want to see if I can upload in 1080p because I saw it's Gator uploads in 1080 and aim also upload like that looks really crispy and clean like I don't have that many points on this alt I was testing some fun teams the other day and I actually lost some points I think I'm only like 1380 or something around those lines okay uh, I got this team on the forums I'm just really tired and didn't have time to build something for a life okay we got score of HPS Landers um so Mammoth Swine is a potential lead right they all lead Mammoth Swine this team is actually kind of weak to Mammoth honestly but yeah let's just lead over with Feeny we don't have defense on this Feeny so Earthquake is gonna hurt uh, we cannot even scald burn him. I should probably go for Nature's Madness. Because um, Endeavor, Mammoth Swan is a thing. If he Sash Endeavor, he would bring me down really low if I scald him down to a Sash. And Nature's Madness is better anyway because we hit the Metagross hard. And yeah, we have uh, Helmet Tangros to check Metagross. It's actually pretty clean at least that low. I think he gets a crit and a attack boost. Gotta love Pokemon. So now I'm kind of forced to sack something. Do I need Tangros this game? Uh, the only thing Tangros does is check Metagross, so I'm gonna attempt. Like, I cannot even sleep on it, right? I can attempt to HP fire if I dodge, but of course I don't dodge. Yeah, of course, you get the crit and the race. Like, this game never stops. I can go to tap. Koku, um, nah, I don't know if you turn would kill. Nah, I think land is still fine, and I can just upgrade because he doesn't have uh, like a good switch in for that. I'm not sure if you turn would kill this. Maybe I should you turn, but that that crit just put me in a bad position. I think it's gonna go on with Mammal now. Okay. Going to Faramosa. Uh, let's just go Fini then. I don't care if he U turns. Okay, Ice Beam. Gets a crit. And yeah, we can fire off the gold now. Guess we can actually potentially get burned since the Psychic Terrain. Uh, since the Misty Terrain and dead. Um, I was trying to get some friends in this life, but it wasn't possible. People don't have that much time today. As we have a Solvus Magina to check this Tabu Lele. Alright, okay, so I should hit on the physical side. Uh, I'm gonna RSV here as a mid ground, cause Heatran. Like, I would Volt Switch if he goes Heatran, but he might go Mammo. He shouldn't go Mammo, but I'm still gonna RSV, yeah, in case he makes that play. And. Hmm. I believe think he's gonna go for Rocks here. But it's just not worth attacking this. Um. I don't have an earthquake switch in though. Fini might get to it killed. Also, how do I how uh, how do I beat this Porygon? I think I might just have to stay in because I think he will just go for rocks here. He just goes for Icicle Crush. I was uh, like kind of close to going to land, and he gets rewarded with a flinch. That's always nice to see. Ugh. Like, why would you ice? Why? You could have gone for rocks, you could have gone for earthquake. Why would you ice? Like, I want to switch now, but. No, I'm not going to switch, whatever. And <laughs> he overpredicts again. Uh, he doesn't get the flinch. A few. Like, yeah, I kind of need my gear for this Lele, but what am I supposed to do when this guy hacks me? This poor. My poor soul getting hacked, like, um, I kind of want to go Metagross, but he might HP fire, so that's not, not an option. Also, Zabufini is but death, so Psyshock will do a lot, so I think I just have to set my Magir and as he, why would he Psyshock? Of course he gets a crit. I, I could have gone into Metagross. I don't get this guy. Do I have a move to touch it when I have a move? I can actually go for Stealth Rock here. Yeah, I like Metagross. 
you don't see stuff from Microsoft, right? I don't know why you went Porygon. I literally have to hammer on this. If I miss, it's just... You get set up and I'm fucked, but I hit a few amazing. Oh yeah, I'm not, not the most quality game. This guy... I don't agree with this guy. I still crushing my McGinnot twice. <laughs> Even if I went into land, right, like he still could have ice shot me unless he's like choice or something. Hmm, this could be like the bloom bloom thing. I need this for the for the table lele so I shouldn't stay in here. I don't think Coco is that important, so I'm just gonna go Coco. Because we eat a magma storm. Oh, do we even live that? We barely live. Don't tell me you're running protect or some shit on a feature. Okay, nice. He doesn't run protect. We get off a huge hit. And now we just click uh, off quick with Scarfland, alright? Uh, off quick just gets a kill. And yeah, I guess he can go far mostly here, but. I don't even like. I can't afford earthquake here. If he ice beams me, yeah, I saw you would like predict my Fini there. I don't know why he high jump kick though. Like he has to be scarf, right? Yeah, this game is over. I don't think he can win unless I choke very well. Um, yeah, if I don't make the best plays in this life, excuse me, as this guy just forfeited. I will keep this a bit shorter because I think rendering will take super long if I try to do it like 1080 PhD stuff. But yeah, we will get one more for sure. Versus a uh, flag on user. I actually kind of want to use uh, a DD flag on myself. Why does the scales team look like <laughs> black and white Rotom? Pharaoh. Um. Farmosa again, and Greninja, it's probably Ash Greninja because that's what people like. Like, the people just like to try out the new mods. So, Mammal lead or um, Farmosa lead or Rotom or Greninja, right? This, this guy has like so many potential leads. I feel, oh, I feel like overall Tangrowth is fine. Because, like, Mammal Swine, yeah, has Icicle Crush. Okay. <laughs> This is kind of bad if he's special. Yeah, I'm gonna HP fire predicting a U-turn into his... Predicting a U-turn into his Pharaoh. If he has bug bars, like, he, I just get blown away. And I just get put in a bad position. But... He has poison jab. Why would he stay in? Why would he poison jab? Why? That's such a bad play. So he just sexes Faramosa turn one. And of course he gets rewarded with the poison. Cause yeah, ladder players always have to hex, yeah. Um I'm not switching out. I don't care if he like Rotom is a problem for my team, but I don't care. Yeah, I knew he was going like I couldn't just give him free rocks and switch out. So what I can do now is uh, Go to Tapofini. Predicting Icicle Crash. Things off kick will hurt next turn. But yeah, I still think I should go in a Tapofini. On an Icicle Crash, yeah. And uh should I just skull here? Actually kinda need this for the Greninja, I don't know what I'm doing. Let me let me attempt to defog here. I can I can eat an earthquake. That's fine. Okay, he doesn't even think that he switches in the pharaoh. So this is probably spikes. Um, I'm not staying in on a potential power up, especially when I have a tangled with HP fire, which would be really good this matchup if he didn't poison me. Okay, he just goes for that. I kind of want to sleep powder predicting a switch, but uh, I'm not sure. Uh, he just goes for protect. What is the set, dude? Like, come on. What is this bad set? Protect spikes. Where am I? Goes on the flying on. 
Watch him U turn into Feral Zone now, and I get so mad. I kinda just wanna knock off as a mid ground player yeah, as he U turns potentially probably in the Feral Zone. Like, this poison just riddles me so much. Of course, these people always get so lucky. Is he, is he Rocky Helmet? He, that set is so bad, and the, yeah, it kills me because. It kills me because he got the poison, but that. You need left or was a shit show. Like, hell, that's like the worst Ferrothorn set. I don't care what anyone says. So, now I'm just re in a really bad position. Ah, man, I have HP fire, Goku, but I don't even kill. I think I'm just gonna. Uh, go on a Metagross and hammer arm this, but. I kinda wanna stealth rock here. Predicting a protect. Because this guy. Actually, why would he protect? Never mind, never mind. Like, I had a feeling he might protect, but why would he protect? That's actually a really bad play, protecting. I thought he get, I thought he would protect to get leftovers, but, like, <laughs> why would he protect to get leftovers when he doesn't even have leftovers? He's that bad helmet set. Which is putting in work for him, but when it really shouldn't put in work. I really want to go on a Tapu Koku here. I don't even know. Yeah, I'm going to go Tapu Koku here. On a predict to protect. As he goes Rotom, that works out okay. I could have gone for rocks there, but this also works. Let's see, I can just fire off. I can fire off a T bolt here. Um, did he show life up on Flygon? I think he's like Scarf Flygon if he has a U turn. Now is he. Nah, he's not bad. U turn didn't do much to Tangles, right? 24, no, that's not bad for sure. I mean, Flagon is weak, but still. Yeah, I just uh, weakened this Rotom, which is pretty nice for my Metagross. And this guy has like a really weird team. Uh, I feel like he's like the type of guy to switch here. Like, he's the type of guy to switch here into Mammo or his Flagon. Yeah, that's why Dazzling Gleamed. <laughs> like, these people are so easy to predict sometimes. Like, good god. Like, how obvious can you be? Okay, so Greninja, is he Scarf Greninja? I don't know what, Scarf or Sash? Uh, why would you, wa why would you water shuriken in there? What is, what is this guy doing? You, uh, does he know that I'm HP Fire Ferrothorn? So yeah, uh, I kinda wanna keep this. But I don't have good switch into my ammo, like even if he ice shots, it's not worth it going to Fini, so... I will just Dazzling Gleam, like... Yeah, he just goes for that, but that's fine. I don't want to risk sh uh, anything there. Hmm. And now I can go to Tabu, uh, Tabu Fini here, and... Now that's bad, because then I'm forced into like a bad position if he goes Pharaoh again. No, 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 it's fine if he goes Feral, because, um, if Feral doesn't have Lefty, so it's, like, getting whittled, so Scalding here is fine. Uh, going Metagross also would have been fine, but, uh, yeah, I think I could have gone Metagross. My rating is, like, actually super garbage on this account. I probably have, like, 70 GXT or some shit. Like yeah, I wanted I wanted to do a road top ten, but then um, yeah, SPL just came up and like last week I just recorded SPL games, a lot of SPL games and kind of lost interest in pre bank. But if you um yeah, let me know in the comment section if you want me to continue my road top ten and pre bank, I will uh, I'll definitely do that. But I I gotta build some like teams. Last episode, I built my team in one minute, and I like I cannot keep that up. As we get a scorpion on the Rotom, which is pretty nice, because um, the yeah, Rotom has levitate, so this is why I could scorpion it. Misty Terrain Ulti only works for grounded Pokemon, so he's probably vaulting or pain splitting here, right? So I kind of want to go Hardlanders. I know it's not a good play, but no, no, no. I mean, Landers doesn't even do that much. Like, honestly, do I need Landers this game? I 
Um, he cannot go for Wisp because yeah, McGeehan has my best play. Um, I guess if he vaults, Mammo comes back in, but that's okay. Yeah, McGeehan has a better play. I feel like if he goes Feral, yeah, that's a bit weird. As I will just Aura Sphere this, pick off his Feral, get the uh, Soul Heart boost, and I think Mammo. I don't know if Mammo can even kill me if it's like Sash Mammo. Which just RSV again. Yeah, okay, he can kill me. I don't know why I underestimated Mammo. Mammo is like a beast. But now Metagross should win this, right? I can still miss, but uh, let's not miss. So I had about 90 accuracy. Why do I not have a 100% accurate move? I don't know where Rotom was to switch in. Yeah, at this point it should be over. Like, I have Intimidate and stuff, I have, um, options, uh, we win that pretty easy too, you know. Yeah, I said I wanted to make this shorter, but I'm gonna get one more game, like, hmm. I don't like this guy's team, it's mono shiny and it's like, he doesn't have any new mons. What is this guy's rank? I didn't say GG to this guy, but I think he left, so... He left before I could say GG. Okay, this guy has a bad rank. If I lose to this guy, my career is over. Officially, my Pokemon career. Just kidding, I don't even have a Pokemon career. I'm just playing for fun. Ditto is like... He doesn't... Like, I don't have setup speed, but so I don't. I think I'm fine with this Ditto. Um, I'm thinking that's... Potential double weather... Chawai Sun with... Uh, Dude, if that's Chlorophyll Tangros, this guy's a genius. Doesn't Tangros like get Chlorophyll? Yeah, it does. So if he's like offensive Tangros, like he has the Sand Rush Drill and the Chlorophyll Tangros, this guy's a genius. Um, yeah, okay. I feel that Tapu Koko is like decent here. Unless he leads with Drill, but he doesn't leave with Drill. And I can just U turn um, to see which, which Zard he is. Um, yeah, and if he goes drill, I get momentum. So that's pretty nice. And now I can bring out my um, either my Landris or my Tangrowth. Oh, I feel like Tangrowth is fine because I can just uh, I can just click. No, no, and then I want to go Landris instead and click U-turn. Depending on what the X could really is. Okay, he's probably like this is his only potential rocker. I want to HP Ice here really badly, and I'm gonna do it. Okay, he goes chair. I don't get that play. Yeah, I really don't get that play. He breaks the earthquake, but I should have just U-turn. So, Zardwa is gonna blow me in the wind now. What like what do I even do with Zardwa? This is my only like thing to outspeed it besides Managros. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I can beat that way well. Like, I have to sex something now. Why would he go hard thought on a Landris? That's not a good play. But I have to accept that this big sweat is gonna blow me in the wind. Uh, I can attempt to go in a Metagross if then Headbutt even kills. Gonna have to calc real quick. The thing is, I'm on... I'm on OBS, so I cannot even pause it, which is a bit annoying. So, um, at least I got better internet now, so... The calculator, like, loads decently fast. My internet is not the best, like, but it's, like, 20 times faster than the internet I had before. So I had about the 76 to 89. So, like, it's a roll, but it's in my favor, so yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk that. I'm gonna go hard and Metagross on a solo beam as he fireballs again. Okay, GG. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Um, yeah, I gotta, like, I gotta go off some choke now. Like, he can just switch out here. Ah, and he just dodges the stone. Like, okay, he. I don't think he's gonna stay in. Like, he's gonna go drill, but. Like, at least he misses the Fireblast, but that sucks so much. Like, he, like I had to go off him choking, right? And he stayed in and tried to second start. 
So he's gonna go into Excadrill really here or to Tangrowth or something like that. Which is just which is just really bad. Losing Metagross was also really bad. Goes into T-Tar. Uh, yeah, let's attempt to sleep out or something. I just flamethrower. Flamethrower, not even for I forgot about Misty Terrain, I'm sorry guys. Foo. Good god, when you're like not good at a game and you try to <sighs> Like that Zardua just destroys me, why why did I have to miss that edge? Let's just go Fini now, god. I don't really understand why this team. Uh, I guess you have to like pay attention. I didn't pay attention. Like Missy Turin with uh, Sleep Powder Turin was a bit weird. I can fire over Nature's Madness and weaken something. I see Sloking, okay. Sloking as Regen, so doesn't really care. I wish I was Calmine on this. That would be like somewhat nice. Uh, why is my why is the phone like ringing on the back? I feel like AV McGee another play here. Future side, okay. I want to RS sphere here, breaking the drill. Cause um yeah, if I volt switch, like he doesn't want me to get a volt switch off basically. And I think I have to go Landers here. Yeah, I cannot afford to let McGee take here. Earthquake to the face. Okay, that works out. And I'm, I, don't, I forgot about future side completely. <laughs> I'm not playing well, God. Um, I don't think he will sack this. I think I have to U-turn here. So he goes tank. Okay, if he's helmet, that's bad. As he's helmet. <sighs> Why am I getting played like shirts? I wish I was like Z Brave Bird type of Coco, or Brave Bird type of Coco in general. Not Z Brave Bird would have been nice. I think I have to go Magirna and click Flurken or I mean he can go hard into Zard here but he shouldn't because I could Volt Switch as we miss a Flurken. Can this game like stop? This game is not nice. Um okay it's like A V slogan that absolutely nothing to the Jack. So I guess I'm gonna go Tango with you. I don't think I can win this game, it's embarrassing. So, uh, gonna attempt to sleep powder here. This time there's no Misty Turin, right? Okay, but he goes Tangrowth. I don't really get that. Like, I get that he goes Tangrowth, but I can just go McGeon on this. As okay, never mind, he predicts me. I will bolt switch now, he, sh he should never stay in here. But. It's like it's just a matter of time till I lose to his Zard, kind of. Um, I can just click T-Ball with Tapu Koko though. I don't give a fuck if he goes Drill. Here he goes Tangros. Nice counter, dude. Nice counter. I will just dazzling beam this. I don't know what this guy's trying to do. Why? Why did he make this series of plays? But I shouldn't talk. I tried to sleep powder when Misty Terrain was up. But that's because I'm tired, right? Like, I'm not even joking. Wait, did I think it was Scarfrill? It's probably obviously Central. Mold. No, it's not Mold Breaker, yeah. So, I don't think Tita can even, like, do anything. T Bolt. Is T Bolt even. Is T Bolt stronger? T Bolt is. 90, 90 plus four, uh, 45 is 135, this is 160, but this is terrain boosted, so yeah, just a uh, weakness teacher. Okay, that did nothing. So he has some Z move. I needed my Coco, but I don't know why he has Z fighting move. Why he, Why did he go for that? Why does he have it, and why did, why did he go for that? Let's just U-turn here. I need my Coco for the slow king. <laughs> why am I trying to sack my Coco? I just go to Finny, Finny should wall this set. I, I don't think I should have ever let, uh, let my Coco take that hit. As uh, he crits me with Stone Edge, that's always nice. I'm pretty sure I would have lived that.
Why do I always struggle with these weird teams on the ladder? Good god. Like, he can just go hard as hard here if he wants to. That's why I kind of want to Volt Switch, but... Now nah, Volt Switch is the better player, right? What do I go into if I Volt, though? No, I think Flash Scan is fine. I'm faster, I didn't know that. See, yeah, it's probably money Speed Tower or something. Um, if his Zard was dead, this would be like winnable now. Do I have to go off a dodge? Like a fire blast dodge here? This Tango is like even important. I, hmm. I think Tango is a little bit bad. Like there's a little bit more than Magina and the thing is I can cl I can spam T Bolt versus this team. It's Tapu Coco. And he, d he doesn't have a switch and like he this puts in work, but hmm. if I had rock sub or something, if I didn't go hard on Metagross, I shouldn't have done that probably. So King just gets critted. This is probably Scarf Tab Coco or some Scarf Ditto. Okay. That's like a roll to kill me. Okay, that's bad. Rip. Yeah, I just lose to Scarf Tabu Coco now. I have to like knock off the Scarf or some shit. So let me knock off the helmet. Um, let me go for this Sun Boosted HP Fire. Hopefully we can win the Speed Chai. I guess he could go Zard here. Why would he get in? I don't understand how this guy's playing. Okay, we get rid of the Tangos. I don't think I don't know if the crit map probably not because it was Sumbus HP fire and he was helmet so it was like fifth death. We have like a slight chance of winning now, but nah nah. We pretty much lose to the He should just solo beam here, he shouldn't risk fire less missing. We pretty much lose to the scarf the dough of its scarf. So yeah, let's just go. Coco and click uh, T-Bolt to pick this off. Like, we made this game close, but... Um, you guys can tell me where I misplayed. I probably fucked up at some point. Yeah, he's Scarf. Oh, he wins the speed then. Nah, no, he's Scarf. If he's not Scarf, we win with Earthquake. But, yeah, we lose. That's heartbreaking to end it up on a loss, but I, I'm gonna have to end on a loss. Jeez, yeah, I'm gonna try like to make this HD quality. I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, hopefully we will have some guests on the the next show on live. Um, let me know if you guys like balanced hackmons. My dude TK is playing that tier a little bit, or like he shows me replay sometimes and don't know anything about it. It has like crazy mons like Quiver Dance, Mega Recreation, Mega. Re Ray Crash God, what am I even trying to say here? Quiverdance Mega Ray. Like entrainment he said something with entrainment Ganger. And you have like Plankster Skarmory and shit, like broken stuff. Like Flashfire, uh Cartana. I don't know, I don't know. Like it sounds fun, but it also sounds very wild and I don't know if I like that tier. So I thank you guys for watching um, we reached like 220 plus subscribers um, Most people are probably just here to watch my uh, the SPL games I upload. I hope you um, I Hope some of you also watch my short on lives cuz like SPL is on only gonna last for like a Few weeks or maybe two months. I don't know how long SPL lasts exactly don't probably a few months But yeah after that um, like I will try to upload OST2 and stuff, but I like I don't al always have that much time probably like last week they uploaded SPL like crazy I went like super say super saiyan mode I just said yeah yeah let's record every game possible and then on Sunday I was so tired like I missed a few games I, I fell asleep super early but yeah I'm rambling on for way too long thank you thank you guys for the, for the support like welcome to the channel if you're new and Thanks for watching, I wish you a fantastic day. Doc Rich signing out, way too long outro as per usual. Classic Doc.